there guys it's Kim here from yourchicgeek.com with a quick video tutorial on how to create a sales page with Thrive Architect in your WordPress website now for those of you who've been following me for any length of time you know that I'm a huge proponent and user of the Thrive Architect plugin um, in my opinion it's one of the most powerful plugins that you can invest in especially if you are a solopreneur that uh, does not have an in-house tech team or design team um, if you're a small business you don't want to shell out thousands of dollars because believe you me, sales pages designed from scratch and um, that are custom designed can really cost a lot of money. So if you don't have thousands of dollars to shell out to somebody to create a sales page for you or to design it, you know, write your copy and all of that kinds of stuff, then one of the best tools, in my opinion, out there in the marketplace today is Thrive Architect. So um, this is a tool that we're going to go through really quickly, and I'm going to show you how easy it is, super easy peasy it is, to crank out a beautiful sales page in minutes on your WordPress website. Okay, so the first thing that you absolutely, would, the first thing that you want to do is um, you can click the link below to head over to Thrive Architect to take a look at it to find more out about it. Now, just as a heads up and all transparency, if you decide to invest in this plugin with my link, I will get a small commission because I am an affiliate for them. So I do want to make that very clear. Now. Um, but again, I think it's really going to be one of the best investments, tech investments that you can make as a WordPress user and um, is really just a phenomenal tool. So after you go and get Thrive Architect and you install it on the back end of your WordPress website, um, the folks over at Thrive Themes have changed things around a little bit. So it used to be where um, you would just get the plug in and install it, but now they have it set up, which is actually pretty cool to where you download what's called the product manager okay so you download the product manager you upload that to your WordPress website and then what it's going to do is it's going to allow you to lock in to your Thrive dashboard to connect to that to pull down any of the products that you have so um, I really like this a lot better actually and it's pretty cool so anyways as you guys can see I have Thrive Leads I also use Thrive Ultimatum which is a scarcity plugin um, Thrive Leads is an opt-in and um, forms builder which is really cool as well and then Thrive Architect so after you have downloaded and uploaded everything what we want to do is you want to go to new and you want to click on page in WordPress to create a new page okay and then the next thing that you want to do is you want to basically just type, you know, give the sales, give your sales page a name. So I'm just going to do test sales page. OK, now after you give your sales page a name, you want to go down and click on launch Thrive Architect. OK. All right, great. So this is where we're going to go over to check out the um, the editor and the elements bar so that we can go and select a template or a sales page template to use for this specific sales page okay so over here to the right we have a couple of options here one is where it says add element this is where you can basically like drag different elements over to your WordPress website but we're not going to be using this because we're looking for the um, the landing page uh, template section okay so that's going to be right here where it says change template. So we want to go ahead and click on change template. Okay. And then the next thing that we want to do is instead of trying to sort through all of these landing pages that they have here, guys, because they have quite a few, instead of doing that, what we want to do is we want to click on filter templates by tag so that we can easily sort through and basically just look only at the sales pages. Okay. So we want to click on that and then we want to scroll down and we want to click on sales page. Okay, so as you can see here, these are all of the sales pages that they have, and they have a lot of them. <laughs> so again, instead of starting from scratch or, you know, shelling out, I don't know, lots of money to pay someone to do a sales page for you, um, this right here is, it's, it's where it's at. <laughs> it really is. So let's see here. So basically, um, I'll use this one, for example. This says Pro Layers sales page so if I wanted to use this as a sales page for my specific brand I'm just gonna click to select it and then I'm gonna go down here to select choose template okay so it says the template has changed uh, successfully and then this is what the template looks like now what I love about Thrive is that you can come in here guys and you can customize any and everything on your sales pages and um, as you can see I mean this is a beautiful sales page 
Um, you know, I mean, again, you can just come in here and basically just plug and play, add your pictures, add your mock-ups of the products that you're selling, and etc. and etc. So another thing too is that again, it makes it easy. It's easy to brand your sales pages and basically use your own colors, your color schemes, and things like that with your sales page. So as an example, right, right here where it says background section, if blue is not your color, if this is not the color of your branding and things like that, no problem. You can just click on the background section. Okay, you're gonna go over here under where it says background style. As you can see, this right here is using a gradient, which I really don't like that. So if you don't want to use the gradient, okay, no problem. You can remove it. And if you want to just keep it a solid color, great. And if you wanted to change the solid color to, to, to use one of the colors in your brand, your, you know, that your brand uses, all you would need to do is just click on solid color. And then you will come down here to put in your brand's color code, which is going to be what's called a hexadecimal code. So for example, I know my colors by heart because I'm always designing different pages and things like that. And so um, once you find the color code or put in your color code for your brand, then all you have to do is just click apply. You see that? And then you can just save the work. Okay. So just right there in minutes, I've changed this from, you know, that bluish color with the gradient background to my own color scheme. Okay. And so again, you could just come through the rest of the page if you, you know, if you want to just, you know, change the text, of course, you just highlight the text area. And here you can just add, you know, add your own product info here. And you can come here and change, you know, all of this stuff and so on and so forth. You know, I'm not gonna go through the whole thing, but all I wanted to just show you guys is is that in a matter of minutes, we took a regular WordPress page and we cranked out this beautiful sales page that's highly customizable that you can again come in and change your color schemes, you know, put your own copy in here, you know, um, I mean, there's so, so, so much that you can do. So what I would encourage you guys to do is to head over and check out um, Thrive Architect. And if you're really interested in, you know, learning more about how to add your own mockups, you know, your product mockups, images, things like that, and really designing sales pages that convert, then you can head over to uh, to your Chic Geek to check out the Blazing Branding Academy. There's over 25 plus mini courses and trainings in there on specific things, and um, sales page design is one of those uh, areas that I talk about. So I thank you guys so much for watching. You know, get out there and start cranking out beautiful sales pages with Rob Architect and leave me a comment and let me know what you think about this video tutorial. And I hope this was helpful. And yeah, um, thank you guys so much for watching and um, I'll see you guys around, okay? Cheers.